I am not worthy of your love. No, no, I love you all. You're so amazing. Yes, my autograph, 150 pound, a signature. Is this thing on? Welcome back to Big Mouth and fancy seeing you here in June. A very welcome, my friends, and especially my enemies. Come in, sit down, no touching. I don't do the touching. I'm back, back where I don't want to be. What a wonderful four days in that hotel. But shut up, Mick. And let's listen to today's Love Island first look. Ah, did I press pause? Basically, these producers will do anything to protect Amber, anything to protect Tommy and Molly May. So in today's first look, you're going to see them stitch up my mate Ant. Here we go. So would you say you're loyal now? Yeah, yeah. Amazing in radio's nice shirt and a bow the last night. Did you get close? I didn't go through anything. I'm not going to do that. I'm getting to know two girls. I'm not going to rub something in each other's face. Okay. I'm not the person that does that. Yeah. He's creaming. Bit of respect, but I, I didn't say, I didn't say you get to know her, but I'm like, oh, really getting to know her now. He's creaming Mora. Whoa, yo, man's got a text. Islanders, tonight the boys will be cooking dinner for the girls. But first, Jordan, Tommy, and Anton, it's time to go shopping to buy the ingredients. Say, <laughs> <laughs> you look like a wise man. I need a face for chicas. <laughs> Conviene más dos de sesenta. I can translate. Basically, boys, what he's saying is, yeah, he has no hope for you because you are. <laughs> <laughs> Hola. Hola. Gracias. My number. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. Why would he give her his number? So what are you like in a relationship then? I've always been in like fairly long term relationships. Mm. Um, I always treat my girlfriends like princesses, definitely. But before I've made mistakes in the last, my last relationships when I was younger, yeah. um, which as I've got older, I've started to realise obviously isn't isn't right. So would you say you're loyal now? Yeah, yeah. Wow, ignore the phone. Why do I have a phone in here? It's so annoying. Anyway, right, so it's focus. Do you know what? I was thinking this morning, having a cigarette on the patio at the hotel before I left, and I was thinking about this, and it's like they haven't really been focusing on Anton, and I thought, wouldn't it be nice if they focused on my mate Anton? So they decided, look, you've got to see this bird, right? This bird isn't attractive. Why would Anton? I mean, she had glasses. She looked ever so young why would he even leave his number was that again i think that was false fed by the producers weren't it so pathetic and as i say they will do anything anything to protect molly may tommy bloody hell tommy's gone from being lenny from my and men right to being the joker in the pack did you hear him trying to be funny wow but yeah it's stitch up anton they will stitch up anyone apart from tommy Molly May and Amber. We've seen it. They're their favourites. They think that's who you're watching this show for. Radio Times did an article today saying, wouldn't it be nice if Amber and Ovi were the first friendship couple to win? No, I like Ovi. I don't like Amber. She doesn't deserve to win this process. So no, and I don't want Tommy or Molly May. So I was thinking, would it, you know, you know, Belle and Anton are quite likeable. Maybe they could win. But oh no, the producers don't want that because they're so desperate for these assholes to win. 
So what do you think? Do you think Anton's a snake in the grass? I know what he's like. I know what he's like, and I'm not going to start spreading um, stuff about him. But, you know, people are only human. They grow up. They make mistakes. Hey, I'm worse than him. Jesus, I'm still doing bad stuff. But never mind. You know, we're young once. Soon we'll be having, like, the um, bags under our eyes. We won't be able to shag anyone. So we've just got to enjoy life, right? So don't be so judgmental. So comment down below. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll be back tonight for my Love Island reaction. I think it's going to be a fully packed, explosive reaction as well.